Jean-David Malo, and he's with the European Innovation Council. And so you've been in CES last year. And Indeed. it was a little bit of a different show. This year there's a lot more Absolutely. people. Absolutely. So I understand you have a database of about 5,000 innovative companies. Indeed. How do you pick just a few to be in the pavilion? A challenge, you may imagine. Oh my goodness, <laughs> it's got to be. No, in fact, what we are doing is uh, we are looking, in fact, at um, the main topic in which these companies are working in terms of technology and markets. Uh, and on the basis of this example, we are organizing a kind of competition uh, in order to uh, identify the most promising ones, the ones that are fitting more with the objective of uh, CES. Because, of course, I mean, each kind of event of uh, this type have a different purpose. So here it's really for consumer electronics. Absolutely. Uh, and we are selecting the best of them. So this year we had the possibility to bring uh, 20 of them. Excellent. So they are all in the European pavilion here. Well, it is here. Uh, so, uh, and uh, we know already that a number of them have uh, had the opportunity to organize some contacts with people from all over the world, mainly American, I have to say, Stephanie. Well, but, we, are, uh, we are in Las Vegas. <laughs> we, we are, are in Las Vegas. Vegas. Uh, but this is a purpose. So uh, Fabulous. this is how we are doing it. And then you're, you're going to be in a few other shows in the United States. Indeed. Bio. Uh, bio. Uh, we went also in uh, Miami, in San Diego. Uh, very likely next year we will, uh, not only we will come again in CES, but we will come uh, with a bigger size, with more ambition. We have already started to discuss also with European pavilions that are around. I mean, as you know, a number of uh, European uh, countries are present. And uh, we will reinforce our cooperation in order to be even more present here. All right. Well, thank you for your time. No, thanks to you.